This is a protest in Utrecht against long waiting times for people cycling at a busy intersection in the center of the city. The Utrecht chapter of the Cyclist Union and the organization Kracht van Utrecht handed out sweet rolls to ease the waiting times and people got information leaflets. People cycling don't need traffic lights. They are only there for motor traffic. Well-designed intersections can do without signals. Some older lights were literally taken off their posts before in Utrecht because people wanted them to go away. Even on busy intersections that poses no problems. Where signals remain they annoy people, especially when other road users get a green light for the exact same crossing. That's when people start to make their own decisions and they will ride on a red light when that is perfectly possible. Most of the time without any harm to other people. A right turn on red is usually possible in the Netherlands anyway. Also in other countries people do this. It can even be safer to ride when other traffic doesn't. But the Utrecht police has a different opinion. They recently stopped and ticketed 144 people who cycled on red at one junction in Utrecht. And it caused chaos. Because everybody now stopped at the red light, there was a bicycle traffic jam of over 100 meters long. This traffic jam was never there when people made their own decisions. That means that something is fundamentally wrong at that location. Just one day later the alderman for traffic announced that something had indeed been wrong. A faulty detection loop allegedly caused the delays and the green times were now longer. Not double, not triple, but five times as long as the day before. The cyclist union was dumbfounded. What about all the other traffic lights? They had been protesting long waiting times for years and now a light can get five times longer green in one night. This busy intersection has red times of two minutes for cycling. That is much too long for so many people. So a protest was organized. People were informed about where they could complain and to ease the waiting times the cyclists union handed out sweet rolls. Many people agreed that these waiting times are unacceptable. Because of the long delays and the many people cycling, the waiting areas fill up very quickly. People wanting to go in other directions have to squeeze themselves through and others choose to ride on the sidewalk. People also cross the intersection where that is not allowed forced by the circumstances and they actually clear the area quicker that way to make it better for all the other people there. It works but it is not the way it should be and it can be so much better if only people cycling got more green time. Even in the Netherlands there is always room for improvement. It is time that today's reality of so many people cycling is reflected in the infrastructure. Three, two, one, yeah, we're done.